Hey guys, it's Garrett Price back again. We are looking forward to our Lights and Libation event on Friday, March 3rd. And I am here with Spencer Kilgore, who is our mixologist for the night. And he's gonna be whipping up three different variants of an old fashioned for us. I sure am. Uh, three of those, uh, what, we're, what we're trying to do is uh, kind of provide everybody the opportunity um, to use a bourbon or a spirit that everybody has in their home. Right. Um, but give them the chance to spice it up a little bit and a uh, more modern take on, on the old fashioned. Uh, one of the ones that we're gonna be doing is we're gonna be doing a uh, vanilla sugar old fashioned. We're gonna be using uh, this bullet 10 year bourbon. It has a really, really nice vanilla flavor at the, at the end of it. Uh, lends itself really well to doing that. Um, we're also gonna be doing a Szechuan peppercorn rye old fashioned. How about that? It's getting fancy. <laughs> it's getting real fancy. <laughs> Um, Too fancy for me. So <laughs> fancy. So, but it does. It gives people the opportunity uh, for for them to to experiment a little bit because you take some of these basic ingredients and then you tweak them just a little bit. And you can make something really unique, something that somebody maybe has never done before. Right. So we're gonna be doing the Szechuan peppercorn rye old fashioned, and then we're also going to be doing a new fashion, uh, which is a a lot more modern twist on an old fashioned. So those are all going to be uh, featured on Friday night. So uh, today we're gonna go ahead. We're just gonna go ahead and. Um, put together a traditional old fashioned. Um, so you've got some of the ingredients here. You're gonna start with your bourbon. Okay, um, my about, favorite. About, always, always <laughs> my favorite. Uh, you're gonna use about an ounce and a half uh, of bourbon, whichever bourbon you choose. Um, How do you know what's an ounce and a half? Oh, that's just years of practice. Years of practice. Years of practice. That's probably, I mean, that's gotta be close. I'm gonna say it's close. <laughs> uh, you're gonna go ahead, you're gonna put a couple orange slices in there. We have clementines at the house, so I'm gonna go ahead and use those. Um, I'm gonna soft muddle all this. Traditionally, you would go ahead and you would muddle the bottom of that all together. Um, but for speed purposes, and just because I like it better this way, we're gonna soft muddle it. So you're gonna fill this up with ice. So soft muddling is just putting ice in it? Soft muddling, you're gonna take all this and then we're gonna put it in this container oh, okay. and we're gonna shake it up together. The ice is gonna do the work for us. Gotcha. Instead of us doing it. So this is these are small tricks that you learn when you get several hundred patrons breathing right. on your neck yeah. and they want all these. Um, the next thing you're going to do is you're going to add a sweetener. You can do a couple different things. I brought honey down here and I also brought sugar. Um, you can also use simple sugar, agave nectar, anything is traditionally anything that's sweet. Um, some people use sodas. I'm not a big fan of those. And so we're going to do this a little bit more, a little bit more uh, healthy, I guess you'd call it that. So you're going to add a little bit of sugar. You're going to add some bitters. So you're going to throw all this together. You're going to throw it into a tin, just like this. Shake it all up, just like so. Fancy. So fancy. Tell me. So That's fancy. a very good shake. Super fancy. Pour it back in on top. Add a couple more cubes of ice, just like so. And then you can drink it just like this. You okay. can add water. Or you can add uh, add club water. Soda. Why would you want to add water? I, it opened. Believe it or not, it actually opens up <laughs> I love uh, it. some of the spirit. Yeah, how so about that? A lot of those little different flavor profiles that you won't get unless you add water. It's the most bizarre thing. That's why someone will ask for like one ice cube or just a splash yeah. of water. So and then you fill it all the way up to the top. Garnish it up. Make it fancy. Yep, just like that. That looks awesome. That I'm gonna try that. You go for it. Mmm. Oh man, that's delicious. That's good stuff. Absolutely. I'm probably try it too. Yeah, go ahead. That is good. That's awesome. Well, Spencer, thank you so much. We look forward to uh, Friday night, man. Absolutely. I can't wait.